So I got the opportunity to travel for work a couple times now, and this has to be definitely one of the coolest trips so far. There's a lot of cool scenery out here that you just don't see in Minnesota or anywhere around our area. Um, but yeah, I'm having a lot of fun looking at the scenery and I've been driving for almost two hours now. And if you know me, I hate driving, but being able to look at all this, it's making it worth it. Focusing on language preservation with um, grantees across the United States and um, when I opened up the statement of work I just sounds not silly but it's true I started crying I'm like God is incredibly awesome you know this is such a passion of mine and I get to do this work that I'm so passionate about and Kulun Sutin the creator is is incredible it's a really exciting time um, with language preservation. So we um, get to be the contractor that brings the grantees together to help them share best practices, provide training and technical assistance, webinars, all of those things because they, they have uh, federal dollars. Um, and so this project is really focused on how can we create sustainable uh, curriculum models um, from elementary up into high school. So they've got a handful of um, grantees that are going to be participating in this project and we get to facilitate that forum for them to communicate and share what's working. So it's really an honor. Is it national now too? Mm -hmm. I mean you're looking, yeah. so yep. that's what I was thinking too, is you're just, it's, a, it's, a, it's this national initiative, this mm -hmm. contract that they have, and they're right in our backyard. Mm -hmm. I mean these, the people who are doing where else? I mean, are you all the way, is it going, you're talking all the way into the Dakotas, too? And yeah, across the, United, across the United States. You know, right here in our backyard, so we're, we, get a, we get a front row seat. So, it's time for me to head back to the airport got a flight late tonight and then I'm in a two hour time difference so it's two hours earlier here than over there in the cities the Twin Cities so I'm gonna get some work done people probably feel like I'm emailing back extra late but we're just on a time difference I don't fly out till later today so I'm gonna get to the airport and return this rental car get some work done the, all the gas stations on the way look really shady and like plan territory so I think I'm just gonna pay the refueling fee and uh, call it a day.